Hey guys, welcome back to another video of Wasteland Survival. How are we doing guys? Hope you guys are all well. So, what I'm going to do is, as I said in the other video, I thought as much that this was going to be a thing. So, I'm going to activate hard mode for the Spirit Cave. And we're going to find ourselves some nice, hopefully, Tier 5 resources. So if you guys aren't aware of what I'm talking about, please check out the previous video just to sort of get a bit of a synopsis to what I was, what I'm speaking about right now. And if you want, head back over here or do as you like. Watch that video and watch this video. That'd be much appreciated. So what we, what the aim was in the previous video was to find out if we could find ourselves tier five resources in a normal mode of the spirit game. And unfortunately, I wasn't able to find any and I figured I'd make that video first just to see if it was a, um, a thing or not and I figured I thought about two things I initially thought that well what I was initially going to do I should say is I wanted to check out all four caves to see if there was any t5 resources you know by the time you get to the boss and you open up all their chests and things like that and unfortunately, that didn't happen. So caves one and two struck out for me. And I kind of made a call where I thought, okay, well, if it's gonna be like that, I may as well um, follow through and just do all of hard mode. And that's what I'm gonna do. So I'm not gonna do all four caves today. It's just gonna be pretty much a repeat of caves uh, one and two. And, I'm, and what I did in the previous video, if you guys aren't gonna go back and watch it, I essentially um, opened up all of the lootable chests as well, everything that sort of came my way, all the little containers, all the little, you know, the non-important ones, so to speak, versus the, um, in conjunction with all the important ones, as you can see, I'm walking right past them. So I'm not gonna really bother too much about that. I may do a sweep later on off camera, which probably would be a better experience for you guys if I did it that way. So. I'm thinking about doing it that way. So I'm just making sure that I've got accessibility out, which I do. And it looks like we're going to need to swap over to another weapon in a moment. So got to come prepared, as they say. Make sure you do the right thing, of course. And as you can see, I am quite um, prepared, if you noticed my inventory. I've got a little bit more in my um, in my reserves and all that sort of stuff. So I've brought along the wagon and I've brought along obviously Horsey who's here with me and I've got a few things that I've dropped off at the front of the cave. So we're, we're good to go. But right now, so far I haven't found anything yet. So, which is a bit of a bummer. I know that I've seen I've seen other videos where people have discovered T5 resources. So that's always good. So I'm happy for them, but I'd like to find some for myself. So I'm gonna focus on the actual chests. I'm not gonna focus on the sacks that are you know in amongst the areas and things like that because I don't believe I'm going to find anything so yeah so they're the only things I'm going to focus on if I'm going to loot anything today so that's pretty much what I'm sort of looking at at the minute okay have I found anything decent does it appear that way unfortunately gonna take the water jugs with me if I find any water jugs I'll you know take them along for the ride kind of thing and we should be all good alrighty fortunately I can't two shot these fellas it's going to be a three shot and I'm spewing that the uh, the acres there are two shot now not one shot so with the the Lamar pistol that I have at the moment I was able to one shot um, acres and two shot the ghosts which was awesome because that just saves on unnecessary usage on the weapon so I can actually carry the weapon a lot a lot longer and end up using less over time that's pretty much the aim and the basis of it but unfortunately this is not the case today so is what it is but let's continue on and power through because I really want to find myself some nice resources but if I can't yeah what do you do you know it's you know, something that you guys can watch, some something you guys can enjoy. If you don't enjoy it, well, look, I'm not, I'm not going to be, you know, I'm not going to be mad or anything like that. You know, never ever been like that. So, I just appreciate you guys stopping by and checking out the video as always. So, yeah, 
Anyway, on that, I'm going to do a couple of shameless plugs here. So if you guys are enjoying my series, enjoy my videos, make sure you do hit the like button, comment down below. Let me know your experiences within Westland and all that, all that sort of stuff in between. And if you guys have any good information that you want to share, not just with myself, but anyone else that touch on the video and go through the comments there, drop them in the comments because you don't know, you might actually help end up helping out someone else. And same goes for you guys that are wanting to find information. You may find information that might be relevant to what you guys are needing to do within the game. So I try and um, answer pretty much all questions within my comment section. So if you guys want some answers, I'll hopefully would have the answers for you. If not, um, hopefully someone else will. So you've always got the um, the source of the Discord server as well. If you want to, um, you know, get a helping hand that way as well. So do take put that into um, you know put that into consideration as well as you, you know, go through the motions, I guess. But on that as well, I did mention in the other video, but I will here as well. I have just started a new game as well, brand new survival game. It's actually come out from the same development crew for, uh, that make Westland. So uh, Helio Games created a new game called Mutiny, a pirate survival RPG. Guys, check it out. Um, possibly at the time of this recording, uh, videos one and two should be up. Possibly number three, depending on, on how I'm doing the scheduling and things like that. Um, I would think maybe one and two, maybe. I'm not too sure yet how I'm going to sort of... Um, categorize everything and uh, throw the uh, the videos up this you know for the coming week this might be the last video for the week or maybe the second to last I'm not too sure exactly how I'm gonna format it yet but I just figure I would just sort of chime in and give you guys a bit of a perspective on that I think maybe possibly maybe the first three videos the way that I'm thinking about it in my head now as I'm sort of speaking to you guys I think I might do it that way but Again, nonetheless, hopefully I'll have something in this in the description or possibly in the card section for you guys. So do check it out. It's a pretty much a a new concept in a way that we play survival. Okay, so there is a lot of similar elements to that of Westland, and obviously um, coming from the Kefir engine, you guys are going to find a lot of commonalities through the game. But there are elements in the game that the development crew are trying to do and implement that hopefully may set it apart from all the other survival based game in this genre. So yeah, it's actually an exciting game. I'm, I'm enjoying it myself. So hopefully you guys will enjoy it too. And that's pretty much the basis and the aim for this one here. If you guys enjoy it, please um, check it out and let me know in the comment section over there. Anyway, um, and the final thing with that as well, actually, um, it's not available yet through all uh, countries and continents. So apologies up front, and I believe it's only Android only at this point. Hopefully iOS players will get to benefit from it soon, but we just haven't seen anything uh, with regards to that. It only has been out for less than a week. So yeah, so just take that for what you will, guys. And yeah, I try and document everything so you guys get the better experience the best possible start to it if you guys end up starting to uh to play it so that's pretty much the reason why that i wanted to make you know as much videos as possible so you guys can enjoy it that's the reason why all right he's down okay so we've got the standard stuff there nothing new hopefully these chests will yield something for me i'm not too sure if it will but we'll go ahead and see Alrighty, what do we got? Got a tube. Didn't get anything interesting, unfortunately. Actually, I will take the bandage and use up these bandages as well. But unfortunately, no T5 resources. I don't know what's up with that. Didn't find anything in here. Not too sure what the go is. Um, okay. Not sure what's happening here, guys. So I might have to go into. The, well, I will be going into the second cave to see what's going on. But not too sure why I haven't been able to find what I've been wanting to find. If that makes sense. Anywho, a lot of empty, um, empty water jars, which is a little bit disappointing. It would be nice if there was, if they make like um, uh, wells 
you know, randomly somewhere in these caves. That, that'll make a little bit of sense, but oh well, doesn't matter. So, what have I got here? My dude is actually getting really thirsty, which is not good for me at the moment. Definitely not good for me at the moment. And I'm going to use up all of that, unfortunately, because I've got no water. No good. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and activate the second cave here, which is conveniently already set down for us. Yeah, because I've actually, uh, you know what? Because I had gone through uh, caves one and two in normal mode, so it's already open. That makes sense. Okay, so... What I might do is, we'll probably end up doing Caves 1 and 2 today. I'll do the other two off cam, and I'll, by the time that this video goes up, I'll definitely report back within the comment section to say that um, the other two caves had it, or they didn't. Did I just get extremely unlucky? That could probably be potentially the case. That's what I'm thinking. But yeah, I just want to go through and destroy everyone, and continue on, basically. Two and three... Like I said, I really don't need to bog myself down in trying to get all these small loot drops because I doubt that if the, the big loot doesn't have anything, the small loot will definitely not have anything. So, yeah, there would be that. And plus, I save a bit of time in doing so. But if you really, really, really want to, you know, get your, um, uh, I don't know, your, your game's worth out of it, then yeah, 100% go down the way of looting everything anything and everything there we go and bakery boom but i do want to get these things so oops take all what am i doing <laughs> how am i doing for storage still got a decent amount of storage so not doing not too badly at the moment actually so i was actually getting kind of worried in terms of um will i run out of storage capacity and you know will i have to make a trip outside to de loot so to speak but so far so good all right knock these guys out and let's race on take down this acre and new tool okay let's see let's see let's see we, let's just go down here let's see what's up here Oop. i think i just i think i got a critical out of that one which is always good would love if I can just increase my critical chance tenfold where I don't need to worry about you know uh, hitting a normal shot you know maybe nine times out of ten would be critical and that one time would be you know not so much I, I, I could do that I could actually do that I could get around that but you know beggars can't be choosers oh geez click real quick heal up before I actually die so far, I'm actually not having any luck, which is really, really annoying. Okay, what do we have over here? A couple more ghosts, and there we go. Okay. All right. Now, I don't know if you guys can hear that through the microphone. You can hear some uh, little whining or revving, so to speak. Someone is outside being very inconsiderate and just revving uh, their, I would think it would be like a, a dirt bike or something or other. But yeah, not too sure what that's all about. I'm gonna start like I'm gonna get, get up and find out what's going on. But if you guys can hear that, apologies in advance while I'm recording. So yeah, hopefully that doesn't come through because obviously I, haven't, I can't hear the playback as I'm going through. So. That is that, of course. Okay, take you guys out. Thank you very much. Okay, and making our way over here. Like I said, I think I'm making some pretty good time on this. Okay, there we go. Go and boom. Take you guys out. And grab that. And I should be able to open up one of those chests today, I think, as well. So we'll probably end up doing that as well before we wrap up today's video. Okay. And take you out, Mr. Ghost Friend. Well, you know, 
my friend, but you know what I mean, buddy. Just want to take you out. There we go. Oh. Okay, surviving okay on the on this set of clothing, which is great. Actually, really, really happy with that so far. Okay. So far, not so good, guys. Not too sure why I haven't received anything. And I really hope that, you know, something does happen. Okay. And probably at this point in time as well, I'll probably go as far as saying is that I have recorded previous video and this video back to back. So any comments left in that initial video there, I won't be able to address it here within this video, but I will try and stay active within the comments of the um, of the initial video as well, just to let you guys um, know exactly what's happening and all that sort of stuff. So yeah, answer any questions that way, but I definitely won't be able to answer anything uh, as of this point in time. So apologies in advance, just the way that I get my videos done just so I can, you know, have them out for the week. Uh, you know, it works. Sometimes it doesn't because especially when you get um, other videos or sorry, when you get updates for these games that come through during the week. In most cases so far in the recent time, it hasn't been too bad, but you know, there have been times where I've been sort of caught out and I have to sort of drop everything, make a video, which is not too bad because I can make it happen. But if I sort of end up posting the video that I, I, I either intended to do on that day or release it on that day, I would have to reschedule it and do it, you know, the following day or whatever it might be, dependent on, you know, how things sort of go, I guess. But yeah, you know, it's the life of a, of a content creator where you sort of got to judge, engage these sort of things, especially when you do work full time and you don't actually have the luxury of doing a video every single day um, and you don't have the capacity to you know set some time aside every single day just to sort of make a video or two and especially when you commute as far as you know as much as what people do as well for me I commute an hour each way so it's a two hour round trip you know, every single day so you sort of get sort of lose out on you know productivity anyway that's a, you know, it's a bit of a life story for you. Not, not as, not, not a great one, but something. Right, let's just deal with you. Very good. And I might just quickly heal up. Not going to waste the next one. Come on, give me something good. I really hope though, I really wanted those herbal infusions to, um, you know, give you some sort of um, hydration, which would have been nice, but... I don't know. It is what it is. Okay, what have you got for me? Still nothing. So, I'm not too sure what's happening. Am I doing something wrong? Or have I missed something that I should have done in the first place? Let me know in the comments, guys. Uh, Alright, let's head on out. This will be the final section area over here. Oh, I missed you. Okay. Yeah, I didn't want anything there anyway. Come on. There we go. Get you. And you. How am I doing for hydration? Oof. Yeah, this is going to be a problem. My dude here is not going to survive, unfortunately. And we're into the final bout here. Okay. I think I might just make it. We're oh, doing nearly, what, 300 per hit. And just a bit over 500 with critical. Okay, well. Better find some water. If I don't find some water, I'm going to be in a bit of a pickle here. But I will take the Ohio while I'm here. And I'm just going to quickly heal up just in case because knowing my luck, my guy is, is going to start deteriorating. So I'm going to have to probably 
take a quick trip back home and uh, heal up, all that sort of good stuff. But right now, it doesn't appear that I got lucky with this, so I'll head back outside anyway, check out the, um, the chest that we've got outside and see if there was anything that I missed out on. Or sorry, if I um, if they actually are in though in there, so to speak, as opposed to the bosses there, because I thought the bosses or the boss caves would have some of those T5 resources there. So I'm not too sure what that's about. So anyway, let's go ahead and open up. Oh, tribute required. All right, so let's just dump that in. Perfect. I think they were in here. I can't even remember. Uh, my guy's gonna... He's not gonna allow me to... Oh, this is not good. Okay. Well, what I'm gonna need to do is I'm gonna have to head home and get some water because I actually don't have um, any water on me or even in my inventory. So that's not actually good right now. Alrighty. So, alright. So we picked up the rest of the bits and pieces. So I ended up getting all of these other tributes as well, which is all well and good. Oh, I'm 10 less. I knew I was going to do something like that. Ah, doesn't matter. I'll grab it and I'll find some. Did I get anything tier 5 related? No, I did not. Coach gun, that's all well, well and good. Bit of charcoal there. What? A like the main one. Okay, I've got the main one opening up now, and let's see what happens with that. Got absolutely nothing. Really? Oh well. Ooh. Okay. Sweet. That's cool. I can make that now. Ooh, that's going to be good because I've got the, the Model 1, and now I've got Model 2. Yeah, okay. Because the Model 1 is... No, that's the Remington. Um, the Model 1's over there. A little bit weaker. So, I've got the Model 2 now. So this does 651. The Lamart in comparison, once I find it, uh, where are we? Does 690, but that is blue, blueprint level 3. So that has been amped up a little bit, but still more most powerful weapon, so that makes a lot of sense. Anyway, I think that's go, going to go ahead and do it for today. Unfortunately, we did not find any T5 resources, so hit me up in the comments, guys. Have you found anything in the Spirit Caves? I have seen it before, but... Not too sure why I didn't this time, so I want to know if I did anything wrong, or is there anything that I could have done that could have changed the fact. Let me know, and we shall take it from there, I guess. So, so if you ended up enjoying it, be sure to hit the like button, comment down below, do all that sort of good stuff. And if you guys are new to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button and notification bell icon so you don't miss out on any future videos. Anyway, guys, I'm out of here. Take it easy, and I will catch you guys next time.